Hey folks, um, next one I'm going to show you is called Elk River Blues. It's in key of G. Uh, first string D, second string B, third string G, fourth string D, fifth string G. Just regular old G. And um, I just learned this a little while ago, and Sarah learned it first, my, my wife, on the fiddle. And it's a real good fiddle tune. And we started playing it and thought it would be a good one to show uh, our jam students. So, uh, And I believe it comes from West Virginia. Uh, this is how it goes. I'm going to play it kind of slow first. It's, it's fairly simple. Um, and there's some chords in it. Of course, your G chord. And then your E minor, uh, first string, second fret, fourth string, second fret, makes your minor. And then a D7, which is second string, first fret, third string, second fret. That chord's in it too. And whenever I have one of those notes that's in that, I'll just make that chord and do the bump ditty, like I've showed y'all before. It goes like this. It's not a real fast t song or tune, um, but it's it's and it's also nice to just kind of sort of play it quietly. You don't have to to blast it out. Uh, but I'll I'll play it a little bit more. It's it's and th that's a real simple version. But now I'll maybe speed it up just a little and add some some things to it. But it sounds good. Some a lot of like a lot of tunes. It sounds good just to be sort of played simply. I'll show you one thing that I'm doing. Uh, the, the, one of the notes is this note here, first string, fifth fret. But instead of doing that, I'm just going to catch that with my thumb. So I won't have to go all the way up here. It's just a lot easier. And I'll, I'll kind of lean forward when I do that. on the third string second fret fourth string second fret for the other pull-off 